it's sad to see this great building go. Dan Cook, the University of Texas at Austin's Executive Director of Planning, Design and Construction, gets nostalgic when talking about the Frank C. Irwin Jr. Center. We know that it's been such an important part of, of the city, to the families, to the community, with lots of memories and sentiment associated with it. For four decades, the Irwin Center served as the home to Longhorns men's and women's basketball games, as well as concerts here in the capital city. We're really happy that it was able to, to serve the community and the universities. But by the middle of summer, the Irwin Center will no longer be visible, and by the fall, it'll be completely gone. The university's history it was painted on a lot of those walls. Jane Crakey and Katarina Pena remember those walls vividly as students. Crakey in the late 80s and her daughter Katarina just over a decade ago. It was a really great kind of concrete hat is what it always looked like to me. For Crakey, her fondest memories come from the concerts. For her daughter Katarina, the various sporting events. Went to a lot of basketball games during my time here, which were always so fun. So, and would spend a lot of time walking around the Urban Center. The remnants of the once beloved building won't go to waste. Cook says the materials will be recycled to help build the coming expansion of the Dell Medical School. That building will be built on the same area of land. Which in a lot of ways will be a hospital of the future to provide transformative care and cancer and other research. Uh, for the community here in Austin and across the region. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.